Welcome to Fantasy Audiobook. Job transfer for all. Sign into Holy Angel at the beginning. Chapter 51. Hiss. In just a few seconds, more than 10 goblin warriors were all beheaded. These goblins look really dumb. They just let Chin Feng slaughter them without moving. That's because Chin Feng is too strong and too fast, and the goblins can't react. If you play, I'm afraid you will be the one who looks dumb. Quote dot 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 quote. Under the aesthetics of violence, almost everyone's eyes are on Chin Feng. That crisp fighting technique, coupled with the killing effect produced by the super high strength value, deeply attracted everyone's attention. Some people even compared Zhang Fan's video with Chin Fang's. It was suddenly discovered that there was no way to compare the two people in terms of attributes or combat awareness. It's just heaven and earth. Zhang Fan formed a perfect team of five people. The killing speed is not as fast as Chin Fang's. This is too outrageous. Indeed, the combined output of these five people is almost equal to that of Chin Feng. Chin Feng is too powerful. Moreover, there is no way to compare the imagery of the two parties. Watching Chin Feng's image is like watching a movie. It's all about appreciation. But watching Zhang Fan's image is even more apprehensive. It's not refreshing at all. Putting Zhang Fan's picture together with Chin Fang's is simply an insult to Chin Feng. Quote dot 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 quote. Zhang Fan, who was favored by everyone before the game, has completely become the object of foil at this moment. After the discussion among the students, Zhang Fan was directly belittled as worthless. No way, it can't blame Zhang Fan for being too weak. If you want to blame it, you can blame Qin Feng for being too strong, the picture is like a sci-fi blockbuster from a previous life. And Zhang Fan's is an old black and white movie. No matter who came, after watching the sci-fi blockbuster, let him watch a black and white movie, it will be boring, and he can't watch it at all. At this moment, everyone in the auditorium was immersed in Qin Feng's battle. There are even many students who took out their mobile phones to record videos. After these videos are edited and posted on the short video platform, they will definitely receive a lot of likes. Moreover, these videos can also be stored in the mobile phone and watched continuously, which can be used as teaching materials for learning combat skills. Hey, I don't know if you have noticed, but Senior Chin Feng doesn't seem to have used any skills until now. Tell me, does Senior Chin Feng have no combat skills like warriors at all? After all, his profession is still a summoner. Suddenly, a sentence came out from nowhere, which attracted the attention of many teachers and students, and sparked a discussion. Yeah, Chin Feng seems to be using attributes to crush the opponent, never using skills. The damage of skills is much stronger than that of normal attacks. If Chin Feng didn't have skills, I'm afraid he wouldn't be able to go very far in this dungeon. After all, Ping Chop is too much a waste of energy, how long can he last with one Ping Chop? Quote. It seems that for summoning professions, it's better to follow the summoning style honestly. It's too risky to take this kind of coquettish routine. Without skills, this kind of gameplay can't go too far. When the words are not finished. On screen. The long knife in Chin Feng's hand suddenly shot out a dazzling holy light, almost blinding the eyes of everyone in the auditorium. Next moment. The holy light long saber slashed at a nearby throwing goblin. Puff Kai. The long knife cut the goblin in half, but strangely, no blood flowed from the goblin's body. Afterwards, the corpse was burned to ashes by the holy light like a piece of lit paper, leaving only a field of black ash, which proved the traces that the goblin had lived. The audience were all dumbfounded, their mouths opened wide, they looked at the ashes on the ground dully, not knowing what to say. Boom. At this time, a pillow suddenly hit the head of the boy who had just mocked Chin Feng. Didn't you say that senior Chin Feng can't go far? Didn't you say that he has no skills? Now open your dog eyes and take a good look. What just now is not skills. That's right, a thing with eyes but no pearls suspects Chin Feng, you must be blind. Quote dot 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 quote. The little fans of Chin Feng felt a little suffocated just now, but now they let out all the resentment in their hearts. The boy who taunted Chin Feng was scolded bloody, and he dared to say a word. But having said that, why does senior Chin Feng have a warrior-like slashing skill, and in terms of attributes, it is still an extremely rare light attribute. Is he a serious summoner? Was there a bug when he changed jobs? 
Chin Fong was originally a warrior class. After scolding the boy, a person suddenly said, which immediately aroused everyone's discussion. Yeah, did Chin Fong have a bug when he changed jobs? Otherwise, there's no reason for a summoner to know the skills of warriors. It makes sense, and there are no such creatures as angels in this world. In most cases, the professional name is mistaken. I get it. Chin Feng's job is, warrior of the holy light. Quote dot 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 quote. All of a sudden, there were various speculations about Chin Feng's occupation. Anyway, no one believed he was a summoner anymore. But their suspicions were not without reason. After all, the fact that a summoner can stab someone with a knife and still use warrior skills is outrageous. Even Li Hai was a little suspicious. Turning to look at Wang Jingming. Hoped to get an answer from him. But Wang Jingming was also in a dazed state, not understanding why Qin Feng had warrior skills. But what he was absolutely sure of was that Qin Feng was indeed a summoner. And his summoned creature is not only a beautiful woman, but also has a very nice name, Angel Yan. This is what the two daughters saw with their own eyes, and they are absolutely unmistakable. So he said, Qin Feng is definitely a summoner, you can't be wrong. As for the skills, it should be awakened after contracting an angel. After all, we know very little about creatures like angels. Maybe this angel is a creature of the warrior class. Chapter 52 Hearing Wang Jingming's words, everyone in Li Hai nodded. Is it a summoned creature of a warrior class? Then it makes sense for the host to inherit the skills of a fighter. However, the nightmare level dungeon is not so simple. If Qin Feng can pass this level with only one holy light slash skill, it may not be so easy. At this time, the archmage who presided over the ceremony suddenly spoke. As if to verify his words. In the darkness above the screen, there were bursts of ear-piercing howls. Immediately afterwards, a group of green-skinned monsters holding sharp axes and big sticks rushed towards Qin Feng like a tide. In a few seconds, there were no less than 50 gathered. As expected of a dungeon of nightmare difficulty, whether it is the level or number of monsters, and the interval between the arrival of each round of monsters, it is much shorter than the hard difficulty. That's right, students on difficult difficulty, after killing the first wave, there is at least two minutes of rest time to recover their strength. But on nightmare difficulty, the rest time is probably less than 10 seconds. As expected of a nightmare difficulty, the amount alone is too terrifying. There are monsters in all directions, which is too much a test of combat awareness and positioning. Quote dot 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 quote. Everyone's eyes were fixed on the screen. Looking forward to how Chin Feng will face the group of more than 50 monsters. Until now, no one believed that Chin Feng would fall into the hands of these little monsters. They were all looking forward to what kind of tricks Chin Feng could play. Everyone is extremely excited and looking forward to it. On the screen, Qin Feng's picture was still being broadcast live. He had one hand behind his back, and the other hand was holding a bronze machete, with blood dripping from the blade. The breeze blew gently, gently lifting the hair on his forehead, revealing a pair of extremely indifferent eyes. After these green-skinned monsters surrounded him from all directions, he was nothing. Next moment, Qin Feng moved. Facing such a large number of monsters, he chose to attack first. As always, with a big stride, he appeared in front of a goblin, and with a slash of a knife, a big head fell off. Puff Kai. The next moment, he appeared in front of the other goblin again, with blood splattered everywhere. Before they could react, Qin Feng had already beheaded two people in a row, his power was extremely ferocious, like a god descending. Moreover, Qin Feng's holy light slash can also extend the attack range of the machete, and the goblins are very densely positioned. Often a holy light slash can take away two or three heads. Ah, but at this moment, Qin Feng beheaded a monster in front of him, and when he had no time to turn around, there was a howling sound from behind. Immediately afterwards, Qin Feng felt a sharp sharp edge from behind, piercing his neck and causing slight pain. He knew that there was a sneak attack behind him. But he had no time to turn around, no time to dodge. The situation is extremely dangerous. But Qin Feng didn't panic at all, and chanted a spell that didn't belong to human language. Next moment, a ball of holy light the size of a watermelon, burning with white flames, hit the attacker's head directly. 
Boom. The sphere of holy light flew directly at the attacker, including the man and the weapon, and at the same time burned his body with a raging flame of holy light. Slap. The blown body directly smashed into the dense group of goblins. Then, the holy light flame seems to have an infectious effect. The bodies of those goblins that were hit were also set on fire. Ah, ow. For a moment, at least a dozen goblins in the field were ignited with sacred flames, and they couldn't help but howl in pain. The scene was very miserable. Brush. Chin Fung seized the opportunity and rushed into the group of goblins with a big stride. He swung his saber swiftly, blood flying everywhere. Strange to say, these holy flames are like poison to the goblins, and like a great tonic to Chin Fung. After Chin Fung came into contact with the holy flame, his speed and strength increased a lot. With the help of God, he could quickly cut down all these goblins. In less than half a minute, these 50 goblins, like wheat, were all harvested by the farmer Chin Fung. Brush, accompanied by the last goblin being beheaded. A door of light also appeared in the dark space. The top of the entire dark space also suddenly lit up with a dazzling white light, illuminating the entire space. This also means that Chin Fung has cleared this level. At the same time, there was a click. A bronze treasure chest fell in front of Chin Fung. It is the level reward for clearing the first level of the Nightmare Dungeon. Chin Fung looked at the treasure chest and showed a smile. In this scene, I don't know how many girls in front of the screen have been fascinated. This, this is too handsome. Chin Fung, so handsome, I really want to have such a boyfriend. If I have a boyfriend like this, even if I want to die, I'm willing. Quote dot 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 quote. The point of view of boys is that it is completely different from that of girls. Did you see that what Chin Fung used just now seems to be a mage's fireball skill? A boy shouted. That's right. I saw it too. Isn't Chin Fung a fighter? How can he use the skills of a mage? Quote dot dot dot. Yeah, Chin Fung is not a fighter. No, Chin Fung is not a fighter, Chin Fung is a summoner. A tall boy shouted. Immediately everyone reacted. Yes, said Chin Fung is a warrior. It has always been their guesswork. But why does a summoner have both warrior skills and mage skills? Is this scientific? Science. If anyone mentions the word science to me again, I'll beat him up. In front of Chin Fung, there is no science at all. First. I changed my job to a hidden job that never appeared before, and then I used my warrior skills and magic master skills successively. Are you talking about science? I think we should talk about theology. That's right, the end of science is theology. Chin Feng's career already falls into the category of theology. Even Wang Jingming on the rostrum was not calm at all. Bang. Stand up directly from the seat. This Chin Feng, this Chin Feng. Wang Jingming scratched his head and thought for a long time, but couldn't think of an exact adjective. In the end, he just sighed faintly. I, is not as far away as Chin Fung. Chapter 53. Ah this. Li Hai and the others were dumbfounded when they heard Wang Jingming's comment. You know, Wang Jingming is also a graduate of Shengjing University, and the job change is also a very rare hidden job. In the entire Tianfu city, the strength is ranked at the top. It's such a boss who actually said that he is not as good as a student who just took the college entrance examination, or just changed jobs for half a month. If this gets out, I'm afraid it will shock many people's jaws again. It's moving, Chin Fung has entered the next floor. At this moment, an exclamation from the audience brought back the thoughts of everyone who was in a daze. It's so fast, the rest time for Chin Fung is no more than 10 seconds. Isn't he tired? It's really too much. Chin Fung killed nearly a hundred goblins without even a drop of sweat on his face. This shows that his physical attributes are also too high. Judging from the power of his magic ball, the spiritual attribute should not be low. Doesn't this mean that while Chin Fang's four-dimensional attributes are ridiculously high, they are also very balanced? Quote. There was another exclamation sound. To know. Physique attributes represent a person's physical strength and endurance. The spiritual attribute represents the number and power of a person's spells. It takes a certain amount of stamina to cause physical damage, and using too many magic skills will make people feel mentally exhausted. In less than a few minutes, he kept slashing the sword and beheaded nearly a hundred goblins. 
This was a very exhausting task. If it were a normal student, I'm afraid he would have collapsed from exhaustion. But Chin Fung. There was no sweat on his face, and it only took a few breaths to get to the next floor after resting. No wonder everyone had such a big reaction. Comma. After entering the light gate, after experiencing a feeling of weightlessness, Chin Fung has already reached the next level. It is very similar to the scene on the first floor. The same darkness, the same cold and gloomy. But. It's different from the previous level. In this space, the color of goblins is no longer monotonous green, but red and blue. In the far distance, there is also a very large goblin, whose head almost reaches the roof. When walking, it tramples the ground and shakes it, which looks very oppressive. Ah, the moment Chin Fung entered. These goblins all looked over with red eyes, looking at the prey that suddenly broke in. Chin Fung swept his gaze. It is roughly estimated that the number of these monsters is about 100. Open black lens bracket flame forest warrior close black lens bracket elite monster beast. Level. Level 20. Strength. 121. Constitution. 108. Agility. 105. Spirit. 142. Skill. Flame burning passive. All attacks carry the effect of flame burning, continuous loss of health. Throwing fire bottle active skill, throw a large fire bottle to the ground, the fire bottle will fall on the ground, and will burn crazily within a diameter of 3 meters, lasting 3 seconds. Comma. Open black lens bracket frost goblin close black lens bracket elite monster beast. Level. Level 20. Strength. 122. Physique. 118. Agility. 98. Spirit. 137. Skill. Ice Invasion Passive, all damage carries the frost effect, reducing the target's agility attribute by 30%. Ice Crystal Throwing Active, throws an ice crystal block forward, 10% of the records will cause freezing effect after hitting, lasting for 1 second. Comma. Open Black Lens Bracket Giant Goblin Close Black Lens Bracket Elite Monster Beast. Level. Level 21. Strength. 156. Constitution. 162. Agility. 85. Spirit. 70. Skills. Berserk. Hard skin. Assault charge. Comma. After Chin Fung used the identification technique. The attributes of the three goblins are clear at a glance. Compared with the little goblins in the first level, these goblins have higher levels and more perverted attributes. Moreover, the collocation of the goblin lineup in this level is also more synergistic. There are giant goblins who act as knights in the front row. There are also frost goblins who control and apply debuffs, and flame goblins who act as mages output. The effect of such a lineup combination is definitely 1 plus 1 greater than 2. If the same number of goblin warriors were to fight these three types of goblins, it would definitely be a complete defeat without any surprises. No matter how you look at it, the survival pressure of this level is many times higher than that of the first level. That's kind of interesting. A smile appeared on Chin Feng's face with sharp water chestnut angles, and his eyes as deep as the sea were also full of firmness that ordinary people couldn't match. Ah, ow. The howling and howling sound became louder. The goblins didn't give the intruders much time to observe. Amidst the giant goblins' roar, all the goblins in the corridor attacked Chin Feng. Boom boom boom. Every step the giant goblin took on the ground was like the sound of a dull drum, with a mighty momentum that shocked the mind. They brandished maces that were bigger than Chin Feng's body, and rushed over while roaring. The red and blue goblins in the distance also cooperated with the giant goblins, waving the bone staffs in their hands one after another, preparing to cast ice and fire magic. There are front row anti-injury, physical output, control, and damage. Each perform their duties, and cooperate with each other in an incomparable tacit understanding. Turn this small corridor into a battlefield. Chin Feng only felt that what he was facing was not some goblins, but an army of thousands of horses. If ordinary students came in, they would probably lose the strength to resist, and would be directly trampled into powder by the goblin army. But Chin Feng, how can it be compared with those ordinary students? Facing the coming offensive. He stretched out his index finger, poked Xiao Yan who was sitting on his shoulder, and said with a smile, don't watch the show, enter the armed state. Yeah, okay. 
Xiao Yan responded cutely. Then it turned into a flash of light and enchanted Qin Feng's sword. I felt the inexplicable extra strength in my body. Qin Feng looked at the goblin army in the distance and showed a sneer. Next, it's my turn to perform. Chapter 54. Ah. The giant goblin stared at the human with a sword in front of him, and let out strange roars. Immediately, those thick legs trampled on the ground violently, splashing a cloud of dust, and rushed towards Qin Feng with a gust of stench. Like a tank traveling at high speed, it crashed over. The mace in his hand, which was bigger than Qin Feng's body, smashed directly towards the top of Qin Feng's head. Competing strength, courting death. When the mace fell, Qin Feng's face was extremely calm, and he didn't even dodge, the strength of his whole body was directly transmitted to his arms. He raised the saber in his hand mercilessly. Clang. The mace directly broke away from the goblin's palm and was thrown flying. In the head-to-head -head struggle between the giant goblin and Qin Feng, he fell into a disadvantage. Even his body was knocked backward by the berserk force. Naturally, Qin Feng would not miss the opportunity, and jumped directly onto the goblin's body, and the blade of the saber slashed across the goblin's neck from left to right. Puff Kai. The giant goblin's head broke away from its body and flew out. Blood gushed out from the broken neck, and then the body fell to the ground with a bang, and after a few convulsions, it died completely. Giant goblins are nothing more than that. Qin Feng narrowed his eyes slightly, looking at the red and blue goblins in the distance. After losing the front row, let's see how you run. Slap. Slap. Whoosh. At this time, the attack of the red and blue goblins finally arrived. Like raindrops, the incendiary fire bottle fell towards Qin Feng's head, and the raging flames burning on it shocked everyone watching. When he was more than 10 meters away from Qin Feng, he could feel the scorching heat, even with his physical attributes, he would definitely not be able to handle it. At the same time, in the air, more than one meter above the ground, ice blue ice crystals shot towards Qin Feng like sharp arrows. I can't go on like this. Once I let them cover the ground with skills, I will never want to rush to their side again. Qin Feng kept thinking about strategies in his mind. Then there is only one way left, rush over. With my speed, I might not be able to find a way out in this reign of skills. Don't be afraid, as long as the strategy is successful, I can not only kill these monsters, but also greatly improve my body skills. Thinking of this, Qin Feng showed a determined look in his eyes, and after looking at the skill rain all over the sky, he no longer hesitated. Then he charged directly towards the opposite side. Slap. Whoosh whoosh. At the position behind Qin Feng, Molotov cocktails kept falling down one by one. Behind him, there was a crazy explosion, and the burning flames connected into a sea of flames, rushing towards Qin Feng's back, raging and burning. But Qin Feng ignored it at all, ignoring the explosion behind him. In his eyes, only the distance. Swipe. Constantly tossing and turning, Qin Feng's body made strange postures one after another in the corridor, dodging all the densely packed skills. It's like dancing on the tip of a knife. But these knife tips can't hurt him in the slightest. Click. While constantly dodging, Qin Feng felt that a mysterious shackle in his heart had been broken. His speed has become faster, and his body has become more vigorous and agile. More importantly, an indestructible self-confidence emerged in his heart. These skills will never hurt me. Just like that, Qin Feng seemed to have turned into a real wind, and within a few breaths, he floated past the skill rain and appeared in front of the red and blue goblins. Poo, poo. Without the slightest hesitation, Qin Feng drew his knife and slashed. Blood and flesh flew all over the place, the scene was extremely bloody. These red and blue goblins are equivalent to crispy mages among humans, who were approached by an extremely violent warrior. Even if you have a great ability, you can't show it at all. It didn't take a minute before and after. Slap. The head of the last flame goblin fell to the ground, completely dead. Brush. A gorgeous light flashed. Qin Feng's level has reached level 17, and Xiao Yan has also increased to level 12, which is close to level 13. Upgraded. Qin Feng was very pleasantly surprised. The most important thing is the change in mood, which cannot be matched by any level up. State of mind, mysterious and mysterious things. There is basically no way to exercise and improve. 
Chin Fong was originally an orphan with a strong character. Coupled with the fact that he has experienced such a thing as time travel, his character is even more tenacious. Unexpectedly, a breakthrough has been made again now. Up to now, his heart can really be said to be as hard as a stone, indestructible. No matter what difficulties you encounter in the future. You can't let Chin Fung despair, he has the confidence to solve all the difficulties. This kind of people, even in a situation where they must die, they can still find a way out. Will not die easily. Chin Fung now has this self-confidence, even without Xiao Yan, he changed his job to an ordinary job, and he is definitely the strongest one. This is the power of the state of mind. Ding. At this time, the system suddenly sent a notification tone. It is detected that the host's state of mind has improved, and the spiritual attribute will be rewarded with 20 points. Face the system prompt. Chin Feng was neither surprised nor pleased, he was truly not surprised by favor or humiliation. Ding. It is detected that the host's state of mind has improved again, and the spiritual attribute will be rewarded with 30 points. Now, Chin Feng's face finally showed a gleam of joy. The state of mind breakthrough rewarded 50 points of mental attributes. This is achieved by Chin Feng's own hard work. Brush. At this time, a portal of teleportation light appeared again, and the entire corridor changed from darkness to light. The second level, pass the level. Slap. A silver treasure chest landed in front of Chin Feng. Chin Feng calmly picked up the treasure chest, stuffed it into the system space, and directly entered the next floor. The bottom is the last floor. Let me clear the level in one go. In the murmur, Chin Feng had disappeared in place. Dot dot dot. Wow. At this time, bursts of cheers came from the auditorium outside again. Because of Chin Feng's incomparably brave performance, at this moment, all the teachers and students were completely convinced. They no longer admire Chin Feng's perverted profession. Instead, he sincerely admires Chin Feng. Chin Feng is really good. A good man should be like this. Chin Feng is so brave. He is a good example for my generation. Chin Feng is a good man, so brave. Facing the goblin army, facing the skill rain, you dare to do this, really strong. I'm convinced. Chin Feng is invincible. Chapter 55. Seeing Chin Feng's heroic performance, everyone was convinced. You know, this is a monster with nightmare difficulty. Each one placed in a simple copy can be regarded as the existence of boss. Their skills are also incomparably perverted, as long as they are hit by one skill, they will be picked up by the following skills, directly killing the challenger in seconds. Chin Feng's move is tantamount to risking his life again. From this point alone, it is worthy of everyone's admiration. In such a cruel world, only such a person can reach the top. Those who are submissive and look forward to the future are destined to disappear from everyone. Chin Feng's approach has been cheered and worshipped by countless people. Even many female classmates seemed to think of something, and their faces turned red, but they didn't forget to cheer for Chin Feng. In the entire playground, apart from the sound of the word, Chin Feng, there is nothing else. Dot dot dot. Have you noticed that the attributes shown by Chin Feng in this level seem to be much stronger than the previous level? At this time, Wang Jingming, who had fierce eyes, said with determination. Li Hai nodded, indeed, judging from Chin Feng's performance in this level, his attributes have increased by at least 50 points compared with the previous level. I really don't understand how he did it. Could it be that he also has a similar violent power? Amplify skills. No. Wang Jingming looked at the screen, look carefully, there seems to be some very complicated patterns on Chin Feng's saber. I guess Chin Feng's sudden increase in strength should be inseparable from this pattern. At this time, Li Hai also found out. He nodded and agreed. This skill is somewhat similar to that of an enchanter. Could it be that this is also Chin Feng's professional skill? But this, a skill of a life profession has appeared in a combat profession, which is a bit too dreamy. The rest of the teachers also nodded vigorously. Chin Feng has already demonstrated the skills of a warrior and a mage. Now there is another skill similar to that of an enchanter. So, how many skills does he have that he hasn't shown? The waves behind the Yangtze River drive the waves ahead. This Chin Feng is amazing. This Chin Feng is really amazing. I'm afraid the best record in school history should be broken this year. Chin Feng is the future hope of our third high school. 
I think this Qin Feng is about to be overthrown by the four major martial arts schools. This is a good show. At this time, many teachers have already touted it. Teacher Zhou, come and sit down, don't stand still. Li Hai waved to Qin Feng's class teacher Zhou Shan with a smile on his face. Li Hai and a vice principal were sitting next to Wang Jingming, but they also gave up their seats to Zhou Shan. Such an eye-catching performance by Qin Feng. Zhou Shan also got some light from him. I'm afraid it won't be long before Zhou Shan's status can be promoted from teacher to dean. If Qin Feng's follow-up performance is more impressive, I am afraid that it is not a big problem to be promoted to the vice principal. Zhou Shan's heart was also extremely comfortable. He was deeply thankful that he made the right choice, and he didn't look down on Qin Feng because of his career, instead he invested 50,000 yuan in him. From now on, the 50,000 yuan is worth a thousand gold. Look, Qin Feng has entered the next level. At this time, a teacher next to him suddenly shouted, interrupting everyone's discussion. Enter the next level again. So fast. Rest less than 10 seconds. Isn't Qin Feng tired? Li Hai frowned slightly, and the faces of many teachers also sank. They all know. The next level is also the last level of the entire exam. The difficulty is several times more difficult than the first level plus the second level. Based on the strength shown by Qin Feng, if you don't take a break and increase your status to full before entering, I'm afraid you will encounter great danger. It might be life-threatening. Too reckless. The archmage who presided over the ceremony also said something. If it was because the state did not recover well, it would be instantly killed by monsters on the third floor. I'm afraid he, the archmage, is also to blame. Senior Qin Feng is mighty and domineering. Senior Qin Feng is so handsome and cool. Seniors, come on, continue to kill the third level in seconds. Create the record for the fastest clearance in history. Quote dot 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 quote. Contrary to the worries of the teachers, these juniors have almost blindly worshipped Qin Feng. Qin Feng's reckless approach will only make them feel their blood speed up, their adrenaline soaring, and they are extremely excited. They shouted while staring at the big screen. I was afraid that Qin Feng would pass the level too quickly and cause himself to miss the wonderful scene. Comma. And the reason why Qin Feng entered the next level so quickly. Naturally, he has his own ideas. He opened the system panel. It shows a check-in task refreshed in the morning. Sign in location. Copy of the college entrance examination. Nightmare difficulty. Additional levels 1038, 3913. Reward level, 6 stars. Close black lens bracket. That's right. The system has judged that the copy of the college entrance examination has additional checkpoints. And Qin Feng suspects that this additional checkpoint can only be triggered by passing the normal checkpoint within the specified time. Therefore, Qin Feng is the only one who speeds up. Three stars have rewarded a gold artifact, six stars reward, Qin Feng doesn't want to miss it. And there is another reason. That is, Fengxian province also has a lot of geniuses. And the top candidates in the province, if they want to hit the famous schools, will definitely choose to play the nightmare difficulty alone. Although Qin Feng is confident that he is the strongest, he has no habit of belittling others. He can instantly kill these goblins to pass the level, and he believes that there will definitely be a genius in the province who can do it. Therefore, if you want to hit the provincial champion, you must race against time. After stepping into the light gate, experienced a moment of dizziness. Qin Feng came back to his senses and looked around. Same as the previous two levels. This one is equally dark. But it is no longer a corridor. Rather, it is a very spacious palace. The range of the palace is about a kilometer, which is not too large. Illuminated by torches on the walls, a magnificent staircase with hundreds of steps can be seen at the end of the palace. On the platform above the stairs, there is a large throne. A blue goblin sat on the throne. He seemed to sense Qin Feng's scent, and opened his eyes suddenly. Thorn Lala. There was a flash of lightning in both eyes. Qin Feng just stared at him, and felt a sharp pain in his eyes. Humanity. How dare you set foot in my palace. Get ready to die. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Chapter 56. A roar came from the throne. Immediately afterwards, a goblin about one meter tall and holding a pitch black staff walked slowly down from the throne. 
tread tread. Every time the goblin takes a step, there will be blue lightning sparks under his feet. Looks very imposing. It's interesting. Goblins can speak human language. Chin Fung narrowed his eyes slightly, staring at the blue lightning goblin with great interest. Before this, those ugly little monsters in level 1 and 2 can only roar. I didn't expect this one to evolve to such a degree. Presumably the strength must not be underestimated. Open black lens bracket Thunder Lord, Kino close black lens bracket. Grade. Gold 2 stars. Level. 24. Strength. 253. Constitution. 241. Agility. 229. Spirit. 286. Skill. Thunder Paralysis Passive. All skills have a paralysis effect for one second, and the duration of paralysis can be superimposed. Body of Thunder Passive. 30% reduction in physical damage, 40% increase in thunder attribute damage. Extremely electric 6 thunderbolts active. Summon 6 thunderbolts to land in a straight line of 6 meters by 1 meter to attack the enemy. Lightning 9 thunderbolts active, within a diameter of 3 meters, continuously summon 9 lightning bolts to attack the enemy. Description. The strongest king of the goblin camp, leading the goblins in the entire instance. Dot dot dot. The final boss with 2 gold stars. Looking at the information displayed in the identification technique, Chin Feng frowned slightly. Thunder Lord Kano's attributes are ridiculously high. Even if Chin Feng has the blessing of arm status, the attributes of this boss are still much higher than Chin Feng. But Chin Feng is not without advantages. That is Xiao Yan's purification skill, which can avoid Kai Nuo's paralysis skill. Let's do it yourself first, try it out, and let Xiao Yan do it when it really doesn't work. Otherwise the habit of letting Xiao Yan take action will develop when encountering trouble, but it will be troublesome. Taking a deep breath, Qin Feng made up his mind and decided to try the power of this boss with his own hands. Purification. The next moment, Qin Feng whispered, and then, a holy light landed on his body, making him look extremely holy. Then, Qin Feng's gaze was fixed, he clenched the saber in his hand, and with a sudden force under his feet, he launched an attack towards Kai Nuo. Looking for death. Kai Nuo felt that he was being provoked, and directly raised the staff in his hand, pointing at Qin Feng. Rumble. In the sky above the palace, a black hole several meters wide was opened out of thin air, and countless thunders flashed in it. Next moment, six pitch black thunderballs the size of watermelons jumped out of the opening, facing Qin Feng's direction, and crashed down. What a berserk attack. Kai Nuo's mental attribute was too high, even if Qin Feng had the purification effect, he didn't dare to take it hard. With a flash of his figure, he moved sideways for a distance of 5 meters. Boom. There was a deafening sound. The lightning struck the ground, and even blasted a terrifying crater half a meter deep into the hard marble floor. The gravel was like a bullet, and it was ejected in all directions. It hit the wall, and it was deeply embedded in it. What a terrifying power. Qin Feng was secretly surprised. When entering the palace, he had already looked around. The whole palace is made of a kind of cyan marble. This marble is as hard as steel. But even with this kind of material, the broken rocks exploded by lightning can actually have a certain penetration effect. One can imagine the power of the thunder itself. With Qin Feng's small stature, hardwired as tantamount to courting death. Rumble. Kino didn't give Qin Feng much time to think. In the blink of an eye, the next thunder attack had already arrived. No, you can't let him attack so unscrupulously, you have to find a way to interfere with him. While dodging, Qin Feng was thinking about strategies. Soon, his eyes lit up. Bastard, you are not the only one with the ability to attack from a distance. I have it too. Holy Light Ball. Qin Feng chanted a spell, and a dazzling holy light shone from the sword. Next moment, a magic ball the size of a watermelon suddenly appeared above Kai Nuo's head, descending like a meteor. Ha! Huh. Kai Nuo was shocked. He never thought that this human with a saber in his hand could even summon magic balls. And seeing the energy fluctuations of the ball, it is obviously not weaker than his own thunder ball. So he had to give up singing and dodge to avoid the magic ball. But, it's his ability to dodge. Qin Feng has already loomed close. Head on is to cut down with a knife. 
holy light slash. Kano instinctively felt something was wrong. There was no time to chant the incantation in a hurry, so he could only place the staff horizontally in front of him to block the attack. Click. With the terrifying power and the divine brilliance, it actually cut Kai Nuo's staff in two from the middle. And Qin Feng also felt a huge force on his arm, and the saber bounced up uncontrollably, almost falling off his arm. You can't miss this opportunity. Qin Feng gritted his teeth when he saw that Kai Nuo had chanted a spell again. A determined look flashed in his eyes. Forcibly holding the saber steady, he slashed at Kai Nuo's head again. Rumble. At the same time, thunder came. Bastard. Do I really dare not go all out? I bet your lightning is not as fast as my sword. Pooh. A smear of blue blood spurted out, and right after that, Kai Nuo's head landed on the ground with a bang, rolling like a football. Click. But thunder also landed at the same time. It hit Chin Feng's back, leaving a bowl-sized scar on his back, from which black blood continued to flow out. A piercing pain passed over. But Chin Feng didn't look sad or happy. Standing with hands behind their backs, like a banished immortal. Subsequently, swish. Chin Feng flicked the blood from the blade, inserted the saber back into the scabbard at his waist gorgeously, and snorted coldly. I just said, your thunder is not as fast as my knife. Then, Chin Feng chanted the divine healing skill softly. A touch of emerald green light fell on the wound. A tickling feeling came. Soon, the wound on Chin Feng's back grew fresh flesh, the old skin fell off, and new skin grew. After about half a minute, the wound was so smooth that no trace of injury could be seen anymore. Ding. Congratulations on successfully clearing the Goblin Dungeon Dungeon. Close black lens bracket. Your difficulty level is, nightmare level. Your clearance time is, 11 minutes and 43 seconds. Your comprehensive score is, 1000 points, full score. Congratulations, you are the first candidate to clear the dungeon, and next, you will be rewarded to enter the only additional level. Close black lens bracket. Additional levels are more difficult, and the rewards are more generous. Do you choose to enter the additional level? Close black lens bracket. Chapter 57. Hear a series of beeps in the ear. Chin Feng couldn't help but fell into joy. The entire Fengxian province used a unified copy of the exam questions. That is to say, at this moment, Chin Feng has become the first person to clear the dungeon. In other words, at this moment, he has become a well-deserved number one in the college entrance examination. Of course, Chin Feng also understood. The final test ranking still has to wait until the end of the college entrance examination, and the province will issue a certificate of achievement after the statistics of all the students' scores have been counted. But it's only a matter of time. No one can deny. He, Chin Feng, is the well-deserved number one person in the college entrance examination in Fengxian province. Provincial champion. I did it. Chin Feng waved his fist happily. Moreover, all of this was done by him desperately. Awakening the angel summoner is because his spiritual attributes are high enough. Signing Xiaoyan, although there is an element of luck, but his courage cannot be denied. Dare to travel through the windy plain alone and face the wolves alone when the level is low. And now, the college entrance examination competition. During the whole process, Qin Feng didn't let Xiaoyan make a move. It all depends on your courage and extraordinary operational awareness. Win the first person to clear the customs. The reason why Xiao Yan was not allowed to make a move. Qin Feng just wanted to prove that even without Xiao Yan and without a system, he is definitely not a waste. I am born to be a strong man. Strong man of life. Fighting strong. A strong man who dares to face difficulties. If the original Qin Feng still didn't have the sharp edge, then Qin Feng who passed the competition with his own strength has already shown his sharpness. Incomparable pride surged in Qin Feng's heart. His eyes were fixed on the teleportation array in front of him. Then next, it's the additional level. I choose, enter. Qin Feng's tone was firm as iron, without any hesitation. Then, after picking up the golden treasure box rewarded by this level, he resolutely stepped into the teleportation formation. Dot dot dot. Outside world. Many teachers and students looked at Qin Feng's screen nervously. When Kai Nuo's attributes were synchronized to the screen, everyone held their breath nervously, and the scene was silent. It took a while. Don't know who sneezed. 
Only then did everyone's thoughts be pulled back. This, is the purpose of this boss design really to let the candidates pass the level. It's not to let the candidates go to death. Let's not talk about this skill. Just this attribute alone, is it too perverted? A mage boss with more than 200 points of strength. Doesn't that mean that most people can be killed with a stick? His physical attack is second to none, mainly passive paralysis skills, which last for one second and can be superimposed. In other words, if you are controlled by him once, you will be controlled continuously. That is no different from declaring death already. Yeah, it's troublesome if you hit a skill, and you can only wait to die. Now Chin Feng is in trouble. Many viewers were frightened after seeing Kai Nuo's attributes. Even across the screen. It also makes people feel heart palpitations. If it was me, I'm afraid I would have turned around and run away the moment I saw Kai Nuo. A classmate exclaimed. The students around couldn't help but agree. The Thunder Lord here is really too perverted. Look, Chin Feng didn't give up. He launched a charge. Chin Feng is so brave. Senior Chin Feng, come on. Seeing Chin Feng's actions, everyone's hearts rose to their throats. Gudong. Even Li Hai on the rostrum couldn't help swallowing. Look carefully. It was also found that there was a thin layer of cold sweat on his face. Chin Feng, you must be careful. Under the various emotions of teachers and students. Chin Feng has launched an attack. This Kai Nuo is really annoying. Although Chin Feng's speed is fast, Kai Nuo's skills have almost no cooldown. Chin Feng can't get close. It's very tricky. In this case, Chin Feng can only dodge passively. If he makes a mistake, what can we do? A teacher has not finished feeling. Chin Feng in the picture has already figured out a countermeasure. Rumble. The sudden landing of the holy light ball drew Kai Nuo's attention. Then, getting close, he cut the staff into two with a single blow. With one strike, he instantly kills the Thunder Lord Kai Nuo. A series of operations are just between lightning and flint. Before everyone recovered from the shock, Chin Feng had already figured out a countermeasure and completed the instant kill. This. Kai Nuo just died like this. Senseless. Everyone was dumbfounded. The entire auditorium fell into a deathly silence. No one thought. The final boss of the Nightmare Dungeon was killed in a flash. Senior Chin Feng just cleared the Nightmare Dungeon with a single brush. Aren't the four major martial arts schools stable? A sound of exclamation broke the quiet atmosphere of the audience. As the sound fell, the scene became lively like a volcanic eruption. FK. Is this the strength of Senior Chin Feng? It's too strong. Single swipe to clear the Nightmare Dungeon. Chin Feng is awesome. Quote dot 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 quote. Both the auditorium and the rostrum were in a state of ebullition. All the teachers and students couldn't suppress the excitement in their hearts and shouted heartily. At this moment, Chin Feng not only represented himself, but also represented the entire third high school. When Chin Feng clears the level, they also have glory on their faces. Hey, why didn't this dungeon prompt to end, but a brand new transmission channel appeared. While cheering, an untimely question sounded. After being reminded by this question, everyone turned their eyes to Chin Feng's picture again. Indeed, isn't there only three levels in the copy of the college entrance examination? Why is there a teleportation array? Could it be that there is a bug in the copy of the college entrance examination? I don't know, who can tell me what's going on? Quote dot 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 quote. All the classmates were dumbfounded. Even Li Hai and Wang Jingming didn't know what happened, they looked at the archmage who presided over the secret realm. The archmage shook his head and said with emotion. This is the only hidden benefit level in the entire college entrance examination competition. The appearance of this level means that Qin Feng is the first person to clear the copy of Nightmare Difficulty. This level is both a challenge and a reward. It is specially prepared for the provincial champion. I didn't expect that the provincial champion would appear in a small Nanjiang district. Perhaps the chief didn't expect that this reward was cut off by an unknown little guy. There was a trace of emotion in the voice of the archmage. But these have been ignored by Li Hai and Zhou Shan. They didn't hear what the archmage said at all. My mind is filled with the words, provincial number. One scholar. Oh my god, Qin Feng really did it. He won the provincial champion. Li Hai was extremely emotional. 
That's the champion of the entire Fengxian province. It is also the only champion in Tianfu City in the past 20 years. At this moment, Li Hai only felt extremely honored. Chapter 58. At the same time, Shengjing City No. 1 High School, in the Dungeon of the Secret Realm. Slap. Thunder Lord Kano's head fell to the ground, and Gulu Gulu rolled a long way on the ground. There was still a strong look of horror in his eyes. As if I couldn't believe it, I just died like this. Rubbish. In front of the corpse was a boy with fiery red hair. The boy is tall and strong, and looks very handsome. He is carefully wiping the blood on a giant sword. The next step is the only hidden secret level, and the rewards in it, even I am a little bit excited. Fortunately, my father has prepared a bottle of A-level recovery potion for me. With this bottle of potion, I can restore my state to full capacity in an instant. I can use it to face the boss of the additional level. Thinking of this, Chu Tianfang took out a bottle of blood-colored potion from his backpack, uncorked the bottle without hesitation, raised his head and poured all the potion down his throat. Surprisingly, the moment the medicine enters the throat, the dark scars on Chu Tianfang's body that were hit by the thunderbolt recovered in an instant, as if he had never been injured before. His mental and physical strength, which had been a little sluggish, had all recovered. Come on, I'm ready to hide the level. Chu Tianfang was full of confidence. But the notification sound of the dungeon immediately made him dumbfounded. Ding. Congratulations on successfully clearing the goblin dungeon dungeon. Close black lens bracket. Your difficulty level is, nightmare level. Your customs clearance time is, 12 minutes and 43 seconds. Your comprehensive score is, 1000 points, full score. Please use the return scroll to leave the copy within one minute. Quote dot 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 quote. Chu Tianfang was dumbfounded. What? Leave the instance within a minute. There is actually a character who clears the level faster than me. How is this possible? My equipment, including weapons, are perfectly suitable for my profession, and I have taken a lot of strengthening potions before the big exam. That's it, I still haven't been able to get the first place in the competition. Then the tens of millions of recovery potions I just took are useless. Thinking of this, Chu Tianfang's eyes were a little red. There was also a hideous look on his face. Don't let me know who won the first place in the big competition, otherwise, I will make you spit out twice as much what should belong to me. Dot 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 dot. The second floor of the secret dungeon. Boom. With a loud noise, in the dark corridor, the last flame goblin was also blown to pieces, with flesh and blood splashing everywhere. A lot of blood was even splashed on Zhang Fan's face, but he didn't have the strength to dodge at all. His body was already covered with scorched scars. There was a hideous scar on his face burned by the fire, and his original appearance could not be seen. The same is true for the teammates behind him, with more or less scars on their bodies, blood gushing out, but they don't have the strength to wipe and bandage them. They all slumped on the ground panting. Captain, isn't our result already very good? A team member asked. Yeah. Zhang Fan nodded again and again, after we won the second floor desperately, the points have skyrocketed a lot. I estimate that even if we score evenly, we will have at least 500 points or more. That's 500 points, enough to apply for the four major martial arts schools. And the probability of admission will exceed 60%. After listening to Zhang Fan's words, the four players behind them all had smiles on their faces. It's all thanks to the captain. If the captain's physical attributes weren't high enough, we wouldn't be able to output with such peace of mind. Said one person. Yes, yes, this is all thanks to the captain. We just lay flat and contributed very little. According to the distribution of credit, the captain's score should exceed 600, right? This score can already compete for the top prize in Tianfu City. Exactly. I think this time the champion of the city, the captain has already stabilized. All four players said in succession. Zhang Fan was also very comfortable being complimented by several people. 600 points, in previous years, is indeed enough to compete for the top prize in the city. Even if there are two hidden professions, Wang Dong and Wang Ya, in number. One middle school this year, so what? The Zhang family's family background is not much worse than theirs, and they have obtained a lot of resources. Moreover, the nightmare difficulty I chose has bonus points, 
so I might not be able to compete for the champion of the market from the two of them. As for Chin Fang, Zhang Fan didn't pay attention to it at all. A profession that doesn't even have summons can pose any threat. After I go out, even the headmaster will personally welcome me. After all, he is the number one scholar in the city. There haven't been many in the history of number. Three middle school. And those junior girls watching the battle must also admire me very much. After I go out, don't those junior girls let me choose. Thinking of this, Zhang Fan grinned uncontrollably. He said impatiently, let's quit the dungeon. We don't have the strength to continue exploring in the next level, so don't go overboard and die. Several team members nodded and agreed. Subsequently, the five people crushed the teleportation scroll at the same time and returned to the playground. Congratulate me. Zhang Fan closed his eyes, opened his arms, embraced the spring breeze heartily, and was ready to enjoy the congratulations and cheers of the crowd. But, the cheers do exist. It's just why the name is not him, but Qin Feng. Just when Zhang Fan wanted to open his eyes and figure out the situation. Suddenly, there was a sound of cursing. Get out. Where are the five ugly monsters? What are you doing standing here? It's blocking me from admiring Qin Feng's heroic figure. Yes yes yes, either get out, or find a place to sit down quickly, don't get in the way here. Hurry up, where did the fool come from? Hurry up, hurry up. Seeing himself seems to have aroused public anger. Zhang Fan and the others quickly found a place to sit down. At the same time looking at the huge screen in the sky. Looking at it this way. I was dumbfounded for a moment. On the screen, there was no live broadcast of Zhang Fan. Or where are other people's live broadcasts? There is only one figure on the entire screen. This figure was tall, handsome, with a straight nose, and a pair of deep eyes, full of special attraction. Can't help but want to watch. Who is this figure, if not Qin Feng? Look further down. Qin Feng held a bloody saber in his hand, and a small blue head was rolling under his feet. Zhang Fan was dumbfounded. This, what monster's head is it? Why haven't I seen it before? Chapter 59 After listening to Zhang Fan's words, everyone around sneered. I don't know. Where did the soil turtle come from? Senior Qin Feng killed the final boss of the nightmare level, Lord of Thunder Kai Nuo. In the end, it was a girl who spoke softly and softly, and answered Zhang Fan's question. Nightmare level, the last level, Lord Thunder. These words deeply stimulated Zhang Fan's fragile heart. How is this possible? He suddenly exclaimed, I was wearing a full set of bronze equipment, and I formed a team of five people, and passed the second level with all my might. But Qin Feng is only one person. Am I dreaming? Zhang Fan couldn't believe it. His bronze suit is equally valuable. The passive effect of the suit increases strength by 20% and constitution by 30%. It fits almost perfectly with the knight profession. Let his combat power be fully doubled in half. And what about Qin Feng? The whole body looks like three or four bronze outfits. Many places are not covered by armor. Just wearing tight combat uniforms. This is the case. Qin Feng actually dared to brush the nightmare dungeon by himself. And it was much faster than his team of five. He just cleared the second level. As a result, Qin Feng had cleared the entire instance. Zhang Fan rubbed his eyes vigorously and pinched his thigh. That's why I believe what I see is true. Not only that, the great mage on the rostrum just now has spread the news that Qin Feng is the first person to clear the dungeon. In other words, he has successfully won the provincial champion. At this time, in the distance, a boy said loudly. The voice came from afar. His jaw dropped again in shock. Qin Feng. Provincial number. One scholar. Senior Qin Feng won the provincial champion. Great. All three of our middle schools will become famous. It's great to be in the same school as Qin Feng. I feel so honored. Not bad. Who said that ordinary high schools can't produce champions? Didn't Senior Qin Feng do it? Senior Qin Feng was born out of nowhere, sweeping all walks of life in Fengxian province, Tianzhao Tianzhao is invincible. YYDS. All the students began to cheer excitedly. This is the first provincial champion since the establishment of number 3 middle school. It's a miracle. Moreover, those in key high schools have never looked down on ordinary high schools like number 3 middle school. 
Now, Chin Fung slapped them in the face like a wolf. These ordinary high school students are extremely comfortable and proud. Even in Zhang Fan's heart, they couldn't help but get excited. In the face of someone whose strength is slightly higher than your own, the emotion may be jealousy. But for people whose strength is far higher than his own, Zhang Fan can't afford to be jealous at all, he can only admire and worship. Of course, there is also a trace of unwillingness, and there is such a spirit of wanting to work harder and improve in my heart. That's what role models do. Chin Feng has become a role model for the entire number. 3 Middle School Look, Senior Chin Feng has entered the light gate again. He chose to challenge the additional level. Good job, Senior Chin Feng. As long as you successfully kill a monster in the additional level. The college entrance examination score will break through the limit of full marks. Seniors, come on, break the record of the college entrance examination score. The students in the auditorium were all excited. While cheering. Lock your eyes firmly on the screen. In the cheers of the audience. Chin Feng stepped into the portal and came to the additional level. The scene in the additional level is different from the first three floors. No longer a drowsy corridor. It is a sunny grassland. The environment is beautiful, the breeze is warm, like a holy place for vacation. Of course, the premise of all this is to ignore the dense goblin army at the end of the grassland and their roaring and howling. Chin Feng watched from a distance. It is estimated that the number of these goblins is not less than a thousand. And there is a wide variety and variety. There are goblin warriors and shooters on the first floor, and giant goblins on the second floor, including red and blue goblins. Even, Chin Feng was still inside, and found no less than three shadows of Thunder Lords. Hiss. Chin Feng took a deep breath. If these goblins were not far away, Chin Feng has not been found yet. He wanted to crush the return scroll directly. Where is this group of goblins? This is simply a wave of goblin beasts. Which big guy came up with this question? Even if this level is used as a graduation test for college students, there is no problem, right? After taking two deep breaths, Chin Feng calmed down again. He is not a character who gives up easily. How to deal with these goblins? Although Xiao Yan's output is high, but the range of skills is also limited, there is a cooldown. Once these goblins cannot be completely killed in seconds. During the time when the skill cools down, Chin Feng's safety will be seriously threatened. Thousands of goblins release their skills together, and the coverage area is too large, and it is impossible to escape by relying on body skills. Huh. At this time, Chin Feng suddenly thought of something. Don't you have a check in reward in the level? Maybe. The opportunity to clear the level by yourself lies in the sign in rewards. Six star rewards. Thinking about it, Chin Feng felt anticipation. He quickly checked the sign in coordinates. And then be pleasantly surprised. Because of the check in coordinates. It's not too far away from him. It was on a small hill not far from his left front. There, there is still a distance from the goblin army. As long as Chin Feng is careful, he can complete the check in without disturbing the army. Immediately, he cautiously sneaked towards the small hill. Soon. He successfully sneaked to the top of the hill with the help of waist-high grass. Then opened the system panel and said. System, check in. Ding, the coordinates match the mission location, the host has successfully signed in, and a skill book will be rewarded, close black lens bracket. Chin Feng was overjoyed. It's done. I have accumulated nearly half a month of sign-in tasks. Finally finished today. This is a six-star reward. And it's a very rare skill book. Produced by the system, it should be custom made for my emperor's body, right? With apprehensive anticipation, Chin Feng took out the skill book from the system space. At the same time using the identification technique. Billion years of starlight, skill book. Limited to. Angel Yan. Effect. After using it, you can learn active skills, starlight of billions of years. Hundreds of millions of years of starlight, active skill, large-scale AoE damage, summoning hundreds of millions of bright holy starlight, causing high magic damage within a specified range of 50 meters by 50 meters. Cooling time. 24 hours. Good guy. As soon as I dozed off, someone brought a pillow. As expected of you, the system. Forever a god. 50 meters by 50 meters super large range of skills.
coupled with Xiaoyan's super high spiritual attributes. After this blow, there are only a few goblins left. Without any hesitation, Qin Feng directly crushed the skill scroll. The fragments of the scroll turned into dots of stars, which gradually merged into Xiaoyan's eyebrows. Ding, your summoned creature, Angel Yan, has learned the skill, Helian Years of Starlight. Level. LV1. Close black lens bracket. Xiao Yan, next, let me experience the power of your new skills. Qin Feng stretched out his finger and poked the little man on the shoulder. Hee hee, Xiao Yan knows it. Xiao Yan smiled sweetly, flew down from Qin Feng's shoulder, and then a dazzling light burst out. A four-winged archangel with blonde hair and porcelain doll appearance suddenly appeared in front of Qin Feng. Qin Feng was already familiar with Xiao Yan's appearance, and had a certain degree of immunity. But the audience outside didn't see it. The moment Xiao Yan came out. These audiences, men and women, young and old, were all dumbfounded. Looking at the beautiful figure on the screen with a dull expression, his whole mind was attracted. Some male students even opened their mouths wide and didn't even know the saliva flowed out. On the rostrum, Li Hai felt that his breathing became extremely difficult. The blood in the whole body seems to be coagulated. Is this peerless beauty an angel? Although Wang Jingming had already revealed some information to him in private. But the moment Li Hai saw Xiaoyan, a question still couldn't help but arise in my heart. Is this angel really a creature that should exist in the world? This is too beautiful, too shocking. Li Hai has lived half his life, and he thinks he has seen many peerless beauties. But at this moment, those beauties are all so weak, they are not worthy even to lift Xiaoyan's heels. Even Wang Jingming couldn't help shaking his head with a wry smile. Xiaoya said that the angel's appearance is much taller than hers. At first I thought it was a modest statement. But now, as a father, I have to admit that Xiaoya is right. This angel really doesn't look like a mortal creature. Gudong. In the auditorium, the sound of swallowing came from somewhere. Finally the deathly silence was broken. Damn it. Is this beautiful woman with wings an angel? This is too beautiful. It's over. I've fallen in love with this little angel. What should I do? Wow. Miss Angel and Senior Chin Feng are really a good match. I fell in love immediately. Quote, quote. All the students, looking at the picture, praised from the bottom of their hearts. And in the sound of praise or surprise or praise. Xiao Yan has spread his wings. Fly towards the goblin army in the distance. Phew. The wind howled. In the blink of an eye, Xiao Yan flew directly above the goblin army. Next moment. A gentle and sacred voice came. Billions of years of starlight. Brush. In an instant, the entire sky became dark. In the dark sky, there are unusually holy light spots shining. The whole sky looks very holy when it shines. Ha, ha. In the eyes of the goblin army, the Jexi spot is getting bigger and bigger, bigger and bigger. The speed is getting faster and faster. When they got close, these goblins discovered that these light spots turned out to be huge meteorites with a diameter of more than 3 meters. The meteorite slammed into the goblin army fiercely with its tail burning with holy brilliance. Boom. Boom. Ah. Ah. Meteorites kept falling, and miserable howls resounded in the goblin army. But three seconds. These wailing sounds strangely disappeared. These goblins simply cannot withstand the terrifying damage of this skill. In a blink of an eye, it was burnt into a piece of fly ash by the divine radiance. Even those giant goblins with strong physiques couldn't hold on for more than five seconds, and were burned to death amidst howling. The goblin army, which was densely packed just now, was killed by more than 90% in the blink of an eye. Ah, only then did the rest of the goblin army react and let out howls. They cast ice and fire magic one after another, blasting Xiaoyan. Even those goblin warriors gritted their teeth angrily, and threw their swords and axes at Xiaoyan. In this regard, Qin Feng did not have any worries. Xiaoyan's agility attribute is already high, and he also has the ability to fly. It is impossible for these clumsy goblins to cause any harm to Xiaoyan. As expected, as Qin Feng expected, Xiaoyan just spread his wings, and his body moved laterally for a distance of tens of meters like a free bird. Let those goblins' skills fail. At the same time, when Xiao Yan dodged the skill, a huge sword suddenly appeared from the middle. 
The great sword shines with divine brilliance. Immediately afterwards, a tornado of holy light was formed instantly, sweeping towards the remaining goblins. Holy light storm. Another large-scale group damage. Scrape the remaining goblin army into pieces. Then it was burnt into a black ashes by the divine radiance. So far, after Xiaoyan's two skills are released, there will be an additional level in the nightmare difficulty exam, Goblin Legion, all wiped out. Outside the examination room, in the auditorium, there was deathly silence. Everyone seemed to be petrified, with their mouths wide open, like a fool, staring blankly at the picture. Second. Second kill. Why is the additional level of nightmare difficulty not as strong as the first few levels? The battle between the two sides didn't last more than half a minute. Was it instantly killed by this angel? To know. The level of these goblins has been raised to above level 25. And there are several gold level thunder lord bosses among them. Can't handle one of Xiao Yan's skills. How terrifying is this Xiao Yan's attributes? Wang Jingming was the first to react, and tremblingly picked up the tea on the table and took a sip, from Li Qian's before saying. Backquote. This, is this an angel? This is too strong. Judging by Xiao Yan's appearance, it is clear that he did not use all his strength. I really don't know where the upper limit of this angel's strength is. When the rest of the people heard Wang Jingming's words, they also took it seriously. Nodding incessantly. For the exam question of nightmare difficulty, Xiao Yan easily crushed it with two skills, so what is it if he didn't fully display his strength? I'm afraid after seeing Qin Feng's customs clearance video. The face of the teacher who gave the test questions turned green. Perhaps, Qin Feng's next class of students may be unlucky. It is conceivable that no matter what the difficulty of the copy is, the difficulty value will definitely have a qualitative improvement in the college entrance examination a year later. Now, everyone's only expectation is the reward for passing the nightmare difficulty test. After all, this is also the first time in the history of the Great Shaw College entrance examination that there are additional checkpoints. Everyone was very curious. After clearing the third level, the golden treasure box has been rewarded. So what about this additional level? Wouldn't that be a direct reward for a platinum treasure chest? Thinking of the value of the platinum treasure chest, even Wang Jingming, the president of the Chamber of Commerce, was a little bit moved. Because, the value of each piece of platinum equipment is more than 30 million. And it's priceless. Everyone was looking forward to it, their eyes fixed on the screen. On the screen, the first thing to appear was a series of gorgeous rays of light, landing on Qin Feng and Xiao Yan's bodies. A reminder sound came from Qin Feng's personal panel. Ding, congratulations on clearing the additional level of the college entrance examination competition, and rewards will be issued to you below. Close black lens bracket. Congratulations to you and your summoned creatures, you have obtained 100,000 experience points, celery. Open black lens bracket congratulations, you have obtained 50 free attribute points. Close black lens bracket. Congratulations on obtaining the golden equipment, armor of the goblin king. Congratulations on obtaining the golden equipment, Helm of the Goblin King. Open black lens bracket congratulations, you have obtained a golden treasure chest. Close black lens bracket. Chapter 60. A series of prompts sounded, making Chin Feng a little overwhelmed. At this time, three light clusters slowly appeared in front of him. It is the two pieces of gold equipment and a gold treasure chest that have been cleared. Qin Feng hastily stepped forward to pick up the treasure box, and at the same time checked the attributes of the equipment. Open black lens bracket armor of the Goblin King close black lens bracket. Grade. Gold. Strength. Plus 4 5. Constitution. Plus 6 5. Agility. Plus 2 8. Spirit. Plus 3 6. Skill. Strong guardian passive, and additional 10 points of physical attributes. Level limit. 15. Occupation Restrictions. Warrior Knight Equipable. Goblin Set Effect. Two-piece set increase 50 points of strength and 20 points of physical attributes. Five-piece set increase strength value by 120 points and physical attributes by 50 points. Open Black Lens Bracket Helm of the Goblin King Close Black Lens Bracket. Grade. Gold. Strength. Plus 4-8. Constitution. Plus 4-6. Agility. Plus 3-4.
plus 3 2. Skill. Spiritual active passive, extra 10 points of spiritual attributes. Level limit. 15. Occupation restrictions. Warrior Knight equipable. As expected of gold equipment, this attribute bonus is really fierce. If Dobby really doesn't limit the grade of equipment, I might not be able to compare with those wealthy students who wear a whole set of gold equipment. Chin Feng expressed emotion. Before that, all he had was a piece of gold equipment, the holy silver gun. The rest of the gauntlets are silver. The others are all bronze parts. The boosted attributes are almost negligible. But now, after passing the additional checkpoint, he was rewarded with two pieces of gold equipment at once. And two pieces can also activate a small suit attribute, which can increase strength by 50 points and constitution by 25 points. It can be said to be very perverted. According to Qin Feng's estimate, these two pieces of equipment will be on the market. Not less than the total value of 10 million. See two pieces of equipment with the wear level. Qin Feng did not hesitate, and directly equipped it on his body. Then look at the personal attributes. Open black lens bracket Qin Feng close black lens bracket. Grade. 19. Occupation. Angel Summoner. Power. 264. Physique. 258. Agility. 247. Spirit. 308. Summoned Creature. Holy Angel Xiaoyan, 2nd rank Archangel. Skills. Slightly. After equipping two pieces of gold equipment, Qin Feng's four-dimensional attributes broke through more than 200 points. The spiritual attribute even broke through the 300-point mark. This is still Xiao Yan's unarmed state. After being armed, Qin Feng's attributes will explode even more. I'm afraid that even a second-rank professional who wears equipment is no match for Qin Feng. 317 followed. Qin Feng looked at Xiao Yan who was at the side again. There was a slight movement in my heart. Xiao Yan's attributes appeared in front of his eyes. Open black lens bracket holy angel Xiao Yan close black lens bracket. Grade. Tier 2 Archangel, 100 attribute points for each upgrade. Grade. 14. Power. 464. Physique. 466. Speed. 457. Spirit. 739. Skills. Slightly. Weapon. Sword of Holy Judgment Gold. Hiss. After seeing Xiao Yan's attributes, Qin Feng took a deep breath. After wearing three pieces of gold equipment, he was already abnormal enough. But I didn't expect that compared with Xiao Yan, it was worth the difference between heaven and earth. Xiao Yan's attribute value is twice as good as Qin Feng's. Qin Feng made a rough estimate. I probably have to wear a full set of platinum equipment. Only then can the gap between him and Xiao Yan be bridged. However, there is still a prerequisite, that is, Xiao Yan's equipment has not been advanced, and the level has not been improved. Shaking his head, Qin Feng dispelled the thoughts in his mind. Anyway, Xiao Yan belongs to my family and belongs to me. The stronger the better, in this way, I can clear the more difficult dungeons and upgrade the level faster. The desire to serve in the army to protect the family and the country can be realized earlier. Qin Feng smiled. Then he turned his gaze to the golden treasure chest on the ground. Squeak. The treasure chest opened slowly. A lavender card appeared in Qin Feng's hand. Under identification, the attributes of the card appeared in the eyes. Open black lens bracket thunder lord's card close black lens bracket gold level. Effect. Enchanting card. After the enchanting is successful, the spiritual attribute of the equipment will be increased by 20 points, and the equipment will have a 5% chance to cause paralysis for 0.5 seconds when attacking. A gold level enchantment card. This attribute is too good. Qin Feng couldn't help being overjoyed. An increase of 20 mental attributes is normal. But this attack has a 5% chance of adding a paralyzing effect. This is very perverted. This is almost equivalent to adding an unstable control skill to the equipment. Xiao Yan's skills are all pure output skills, and Qin Feng is worried that he has no skills that can provide Xiao Aka Yan with stable control. Now with the paralyzing effect, coupled with Xiao Yan's invincible output, wouldn't it mean that gods block and kill gods, and Buddhas block and kill Buddhas? Equipment, experience, attribute points, enchanted cards, this is not a copy of the college entrance examination. This is simply a resource warehouse.
This reward is too generous. After Chin Feng loaded all the items into the system space. Then he took out the return scroll and tore it up. The whole person was enveloped by a white light. After a few seconds, it disappeared in place. At this time, many students have been teleported back to the playground one after another. However, the faces of these candidates were all very uniformly filled with surprise. Because many students in the audience were telling them about Chin Feng's heroic deeds vividly. Even those students who failed the exam temporarily forgot their sadness, and were taken aback by the words of these students watching the battle. It was as if he suspected that he was listening to a fairy tale. Look, Senior Chin Feng has come out. At this moment, a loud voice resounded through the playground. Everyone quickly looked towards the center of the playground. A handsome and tall man stood there quietly, looking extremely chic. Wow, it's really Senior Chin Feng. He's even more handsome than on the screen. I fell in love straight away, she's so handsome and strong, I'm falling. Not only have I fallen, but my mother has also fallen. So handsome, so powerful. After seeing Chin Feng, all the students are crazy. They waved their flags and shouted. Some students even read the railing directly. He ran towards Chin Feng's direction. These students held paper and pens in their hands, and it seemed that they wanted to sign their names. Oh my god. Chin Feng was frightened by the battle. He felt that the temperament of hundreds of little fans rushing towards him was no less than those of the goblin army. Too crazy. Go back to your original position. Teachers of all classes, maintain order. Anyone who dares to disturb Chin Feng will be punished once. Fortunately, at this moment, Li Hai's anxious cry sounded on the radio. This weakened the enthusiasm of the students a little. But there were still quite a few people who didn't listen to dissuasion at all and rushed in front of Chin Feng. Comma. Enthusiasm was completely irrepressible. Chin Feng was completely overwhelmed by the crowd. Five minutes later. Corner of the playground. Chin Feng wiped off the lipstick on his face, looked back at the crowd that was still moving towards the center, and sighed. It's crazy. It's crazy. I'd rather face an army of 100,000 monsters than he would ever face such a scene again. Chin Feng grabbed the clothes that had been torn many times by everyone, and walked towards the rostrum. Chin Feng, your popularity is no less than that of a traffic star. Seeing Chin Feng approaching, Li Hai hurried up and said with a smile. Oh, Principal Li, why are you making fun of me? After all, Li Hai is an elder, and Chin Feng was still a little shy when he heard the elder making fun of him. Ha ha ha, if you don't talk about it, don't talk about it. Li Hai first ordered all the teachers to go down to maintain order, then he looked at Chin Feng and said. Chin Feng, you have one honor for the school this time. You are the pride of our number. Three middle school. Go to the photo studio to take a picture later, and I'll hang it on the celebrity wall for you. That's not good, principal. Chin Feng waved his hand hastily. Okay, everything is up to you. Li Hai smiled, don't force it. After finishing speaking, Li Hai pointed to the handsome middle-aged man standing beside him, and introduced. This is the president of Wang's Chamber of Commerce, Mr. Wang Jingming. This time, President Wang came to watch your competition specially. You should get to know him well. Wang Jingming invested in the orphanage. I gave myself another chance to copy the difficult secret realm. Chin Feng has long wanted to pay a visit. I didn't expect to see a real person here. Dang even bowed slightly, made a salute, and said. Hello, Uncle Wang. Chin Feng, you did well. Wang Jingming patted Chin Feng's arm very kindly. The reason why I watched your game this time is because my two girls are talking about you at home all day. I am also very curious about you. I saw it today, and it was as expected. He is really a young hero. How about this? You are free some other day. Come to my house directly. Uncle Wang will treat you well. Chin Feng understood what Wang Jingming meant. This is to discover his potential and want to make friends with Chin Feng one step further. And Chin Feng had no reason to refuse. One is that Wang Ya's relationship is here. The second is that the Wang's Chamber of Commerce is powerful in Tianfu City, and it will definitely help the orphanage a lot. Chin Feng directly agreed. Okay, if Uncle Wang doesn't dislike it, within three days, I will pay a visit. Okay, okay. Wang Jingming smiled with satisfaction, then took his leave and left. 
After Wang Jingming left, Li Hai said again, Qin Feng, if you have nothing to do, go back first. It is estimated that the special envoys from the four universities will be back soon. I will notify you when the time comes. In addition, the rewards in the city and the province will also be distributed on time after the results of the college entrance examination are released. Remember to come to the school to collect them. Aha! Chin Feng nodded and agreed. Then he turned down the dinner invitation of the school leaders, took his leave and left. There is a world of warriors. The efficiency of official affairs seems to be much faster. Only three days have passed since the college entrance examination. Early this morning, Fengxian Province, the news of the release of the college entrance examination came down. Chin Feng didn't bother to check his grades. Because he already knew. I must be the provincial champion. But Dean Wang seemed very excited. As soon as the news came down, he picked up his phone and checked the results. After seeing Qin Feng's ranking and score, Wang Chenghai was almost so excited that he burst into tears. But after all, he is a person who has experienced life and death on the battlefield. Soon it calmed down. Pointing to Qin Feng's score, he said with a smile. 1001 points, ha ha ha. This score is good. Don't look at it as just beating the second place by one point, but just this one point is the distance between heaven and earth. It looks like 1,001 points, but it can be regarded as 10,000 points, 100,000 points, or even infinite scores. Zhao Feng, you deserve the title of champion. It's a pity that the National College Entrance Examination questions are not uniform, otherwise, you would be the number one scholar in the country. I heard what Wang Chenghai said. Qin Feng also raised his head to look at the screen. Sure enough, I found that the score after my name was 1,001 points can't help shaking his head. This score is a bit hateful. It will not be the teacher who gave the exam questions. See yourself passing through his carefully designed additional levels in seconds. Take a little revenge on yourself. 1001 is only one point ahead of second place. This insult is really strong enough. It is estimated that the second classmate named Chu Tianfeng. Energy explosion. But Qin Feng smiled, and he forgot about it. Would a tiger worry about a sheep holding a grudge against him? Obviously not. If Chu Tianfeng is overwhelmed, dare to trouble Qin Feng. Then Qin Feng doesn't mind letting him know how big the gap is. Tianfu City has a champion. The news spread to every corner of Fengxian province within a few hours. When hearing the name Tianfu City, many young people in Fengxian province have reacted. It turns out that in the north of Fengxian province, there is another unknown small city called Tianfu City. There are even many people of the older generation. I also forgot how long I hadn't heard this name. So, the news of a provincial champion came out of Tianfu City, and the regiment was particularly explosive. Just a few hours, reporters from major newspapers in the province flocked here. The third high school in Nanjiang district was completely surrounded. The college entrance examination is over. But the juniors and juniors in the first and second grades are still in class. While they are in class. Then I saw a group of people with cameras rushing into the classroom. Almost stuffed the microphone into the mouth of a student at the door, and asked. Hello, classmate. What do you think of Qin Feng, the number one student in the college entrance examination? The classmate cleared his mind. Eyes shone with adoration said with a pious face. How should I put it? The first time I met senior Qin Feng was during the college entrance examination competition. As soon as he appeared on the stage, he amazed my entire youth. I think I will never forget Qin Feng's heroic fighting posture in my life. After hearing this, the reporter was a little dazed. This is a little too licking. So he quickly moved the microphone to another female classmate. The female classmate straightened her hair and said with a smile. Senior Chin Feng is really handsome. If Senior Chin Feng is willing, I can give him three words, I am willing. Senior Chin Feng, I love you. Obediently, the reporter was completely dumbfounded. This group of students are all fans of Chin Feng. Can't get any useful information at all. Then, he handed the microphone to the young female teacher on the podium. The female teacher blushed a little and said. Chin Feng, tall and handsome, powerful, with smooth skin. When he came out of the dungeon that day, I squeezed in and gave him a kiss.
quote question mark question mark question mark quote. The reporter is stupid. Get out of the library. Let me cut out all this paragraph. Then, comma, the reporter interviewed more than a dozen students from different classes and genders one after another. I found that these students can't even describe Chin Feng with admiration, it can be said to be admiration. Worship to the point of obsession. One reporter even said something bad about Chin Feng. Was beaten by his classmates. His face was covered in blood, and he was taken directly to the hospital. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.